two CHL outsiders began their quest for a quarterfinal place in southwestern Sweden. Malmö is in its first European campaign, while Ocelari Trinets lost its only previous CHL knockout stage tie to HV71 Jernschirpen. Malmö in the dark red jerseys coming forward. Left wing, Daniel Saar off the goal post. Just past the halfway mark of the first period, Simon Hubet's beaten. A pipe coming to his rescue. Later on in the first period, Malmö is still attacking. Puck coming in front, again off the pipe. This time with Frederick Storm lurking in front. The deflection onto the goal post again. Still no score. Then the other end, the pipe hit. That a long shot from the left point past Oscar Alsenfeld. Marion Adamek banging the pipe. No goals, three goal posts in that first 20 minutes. Second period, giveaway, chance here in front and into the net by Nicholas Hart, opening the scoring for Malmo Redhawks. Frederick Storm credited with the assist. Off the board, springing Hart loose. Rubets beaten cleanly. Malmer the one nothing lead. Trying to extend their advantage as well. This is Storm coming in front, but this time Rubets standing firm. Storm, the provider of the first goal, can't turn score for the second. Rubets reading that maneuver well. Malmer though, not done yet. Max Gertz, the strong move in front, but this time the dragging right pad saved by Frubetz. Again, it was Storm with the pass. Gertz denied by Frubetz. Score stayed 1-0 after two. And right at the start of the third period, Trinets the puck onto Martin Adamski, draws out Alsenfeld on a plate for Vladimir Svacina to give Trinets their first goal. Svacina on the doorstep. Oh, the great running by Adamski. 1-1 the score now. And right at the end of the third period, still 1-1, but the puck in front, and Aaron Chimilevsky getting credit for the goal. David Musil, the pass in front. Chimilevsky, the tip. He celebrates. Well, he might. Trinets, the 2-1 win in Sweden. They take the aggregate lead back to the Czech Republic.